G'day everyone, I'm here today to show you how to use Steam Idle Master Extended Edition. How to install it, how to run it, how to log into it, all that. Now let's do this. First, open up your browser, go to this web page here, GitHub. I'll leave the link down in the description below. Do your direct download zip archive when you've done that. Go to your downloads, right click, extract all to wherever you want it. I got mine on a file on my desktop which I'll open up right now for you once you've extracted it go into that click idle master extended exe and this will pop up now you've got that you want to click sign in once you do that you'll get session ID and steam login secure these are the two we want don't worry about the third one it's not required. Right now, go to Steam. Go from Community. Click Home. You right click. Go Inspect. You want to click Application. You want to find Cookies. Drop this down. Click Steam Community right here. Got Session ID right here. You'll get down here code. Oh my god, it's a bit of pain. You copy that, Control C, minimize this. Come here, Session ID, Control V, paste that in. Go back here to your browser. We want Steam Login Secure, which is here. Again, you'll get a long line of code down the bottom. Control C to copy it. Minimize this again. Back to this. Control V, paste it. Click Update. It will validate. It will log you in. And it will start reading everything. And as you can see, I have 137 games left to idle, 31 are idle now. I have 515 card drops remaining. Every five minutes it will check. You can also, to optimize this really, really fast, to do multiple games at once, like I am, click File, Settings. You don't want it to go to sleep. You want Fast Mode. And... Whichever one you want there. The island order is up to you. That doesn't matter. I just leave it alphabetical. Makes it so much easier. If you like Dark Theme, you can also click Dark Theme. Yeah, references, I guess. Click Accept. And it'll probably bring up a message and say you need to restart the application. Which is a simple close it, reopen it, and you're good as gold. And that's how you do it. And I've been using it for a long time. It works fine. And I'll show you on the next check what it does so I'll skip the video till then all right it's just about done now we'll get to see what it does see it just reads my reads my bad page again loads of games and as you see just click from Every five seconds. Now I'll bring up my Steam to show you what it's also doing. As you can see, it just flicks through all my games. And it's easy as that. Hope you found this helpful. Please uh, throw me a like, a sub, if you really like this video and found it helpful. Also hype it if you can. You get a week to do that, so when it first comes out. Appreciate you watching. Thanks. See you in the next one.